Hey what's up guys welcome back to my channel your team Jonas Lugamers so I'm back with another Dream Cricket 24 video so on my previous bowling trick video guys I just showed you on how to bowl maidens and play a comp competitive game of cricket so on this video guys I'll just let you know on how to dominate with the bowling in Dream Cricket 24 and just take all the 10 wickets in less than 2 overs so shout out to my friend Karthik from USA so he discovered this trick and Look at his team guys, he got a 71 overall team right here in the top. We're going to see Corey Anderson, Ibrahim Zaldran right there and in at 3 we're going to see Dwayne Smith and in at 4 we're going to see Av right there. And for the bowling, so Lockie Ferguson and Mujibur Rahman are highlighting this team. So if you just want me to rate your teams guys, so you can just drop down your teams uh, to the link I'm providing in the comment section so you can just do it there and I'll just rate your teams so now guys let's go we have like 462 World Cup tickets and let's see and we're gonna see Mujibur Rahman so 81 overall and this Mujibur Rahman gonna push my team to 75 overall so let's do my same time and start the trick guys so let's go so we are playing on the 5 over tournament hard mode so you can just also use this on the super over mode so since it is easy but let me just show you on this one so that you will just have a perfect example so let's go and the toss uh, bro so they want the toss and they elected to bowl first so all right so we're gonna bat first but that's not a problem i'll just skip the innings for you so that you can just see only the bowling part make only to warner right now and it's in the slot and Warner wax it away for a back foot six right there. That's a good shot. 20 minutes later. So it's Mitchell Santner to Stoinis right here. And Stoinis wax it away for a big six and he gives us a competitive total right here. So 60 runs already with a ball left. Look at that. So massive cow drive right there. So last and final delivery of this innings and Stoinis. Miss times that one but it's it lands in the no man's land and they're running for two right there and looks like they are safe. So the total to chase down for New Zealand is 64 in just 30 deliveries. So now the big trick starts guys so you can just change it to Mitchell Stark right here who can bowl 160 kilometers per hour. So that's what the important trick is so you just always need to have fast bowlers so really fast so not the 145 case but i recommend 160 case so let's see the pitch of the ball guys so you have to just always pitch the ball on batsman shoe right here just on the middle of the batsman shoe and you have to keep it an outswinger with maximum speed so 160 case ball coming right away and look at that <laughs> so he couldn't even play that so uh, when you just keep pitch the ball uh, away from the batsman I mean like on his shoe so he just leaves the ball thinking it as a wide but you will just keep it as a out swinger so it just swings onto the wicket and he'll just give away his wicket without offering any shot so let's look what Rachin Ravindra does on this delivery and he couldn't do anything on the one too <laughs> so look at that so 2 and 2 for Stark and he's on a hat trick right now so Darren Mitchell comes out so let's go and make sure that you always bowl around the wicket guys so make sure that you always pitch on batsman's boot and look at that so keep it an outswinger full paced outswinger and let's see what Darren Mitchell does on this one and oh bro so look at that so he swings that one but that's too late All right so now let's see another ball and we're just pitching it on his shoes once again so let's see what he can do on this delivery and start with a 160k ball and look at that so that's a perfect defense right there from Darrell Mitchell and that's not a problem so even if you just uh, uh, even if your opponent just defense or don't score any runs so no problem at all guys so be realistic I mean like you can just get your team all out under 10 so that's not a problem so Make sure that you just bowl this and look at that. So Darren Mitchell has fallen in our trap and we get to see three wicket made in, in this over so far. So now let's go and face the 
final delivery of Stark right here. And let's see what we got to do. And Stark charging up and oh bro look at that. <laughs> so that's uh, just a swing right there and they couldn't get any runs of this. So three wicket made in as I told earlier. So we bowled in over with Cummins guys and he considered like seven runs. But now we are back with Stark once again. So let's go and keep it on the 160k mark and let's outswing from the batsman shoes. So let's go and see what we can do and it's Will Young facing us and and oh look at that so that's a good shot but uh, our fielders were jab back right there so make sure that you always place an attacking one field set guys so that you just don't leave any gaps and your opponent don't get easy runs so look at this so you can also use Australian lineup in your World Cups guys let's go and look at that <laughs> So, start getting 4 wickets already. So, he's just 1 wicket away from a 5 wicket back right there. And let's go and let's set it for an out swinger and let's see. So, the earlier trick I showed you was for a competitive cricket guys. I meant like to get maidens and all that stuff. But now, it's this trick is just for to get a lot of wickets and look at that. So, easy wickets I should say. <laughs> Easy wickets, I should say. Yes, easy wickets. And let's see. Another ball. So this time to a left-hander. So make sure that you always move around. So ball around the wicket so that you can just ball that on his shoes and keep it an outswinger so that it don't go for a wide. And make sure that you always have a max speed so that he can just couldn't connect the ball and it just goes on to the wicket and you'll just get a wicket. So Stark missed a hat trick right there. So now let's go. So it's another ball. So Mark Chapman deceived that hat trick right there and on this delivery and he's gone. Let's go. So he's saved from the hat trick but he couldn't get away his wicket. Let's go. So now guys, so let's see, Stark already got 6 wickets in this innings without conceding a run. So let's go. And for a ball right here. And last ball of Stark's innings. And look at that. There's a Stark getting another wicket right there. So Mitchell Sandner has to depart right there, shattering his thumbs. So now guys, so the second uh, fastest bowler on my team is comments with 145k so, so let's go and look at that so they were facing 160k all the time and just after facing a slower delivery at 145k so just they just whipped it for four so now let's see just keep just trust the process guys so no matter your bowler is 145k or 160k so you just need to bowl it on the shoes keep it an out swinger and look at that so that's another wicket right there and they're just like two, eight, eight wicket down right there. So coming is getting his first wickets on this one. So let's go guys. So let's bowl with Cummins and let's see what he can do. So he already got a wicket and let's see. And oh bro. So that's a decent flick right there. And if your batsman is hitting you on that pace. I mean like he, if he's hitting uh, for boundaries or sixes. You just need to slow your delivery I mean like bowl it at 100 k's and then come back to the 145 k's and your batsman will be completely deceived by your variations and he'll just give away free wickets. So Cummins is on a roll right here and he's just one wicket away from finishing this innings and winning the match for us. So let's go captain and let's see what we can do on the final delivery featuring Cummins and he gets the wicket for us and that's it guys. So we win this one. So New Zealand are all out for just 12 runs and we win this game by 52 runs. So that's insane. And if you're new here, please subscribe my channel guys so that it will just help me to grow a, a large number of audience featuring Dream Cricket 24. And if you enjoy this, please drop a like and you can just give me your player ids or your team photos in the link provided in the comment section so that i can just review your teams thank you very much